is correctness. One other arrogant, selfish, condemned by humans. To control somebody else's life. In my opinion, you can say what you want. I don't care about that. The only thing where I care about is that you don't act out your violent desires. You can say what you want. You can believe what you want. But you have not the right to act out your violent behavior. You can say that I've been an asshole. You can say I've been an hate. I've been an uh, hater. You can say that I've been angry. You can say that I've been nice. And you can say anything about me. But act out your violent desires on somebody else. That's not an okay. You can say that you want to kill the whole world. I don't care. As long as you don't act out that desire. You can say, if you ask me, that you uh, can, yes, actually, I think it is not somebody's business to control somebody else's language. I think that is not the solution of it. There's only a part of the problem. It is, it is not the solution of it to go uh, damage and I decreased somebody's language. These people can have it, ideas and feelings, but I don't have to act it out. And if you limit somebody else's speech because somebody else don't can handle that, come over this. Spectacular if you live in the first world. If you've been a white or black privilege, rich guy or boy, or some lesser of middle class human in the first world, live in America or you live in Europe or something. And you have not to feel offended by somebody else's words. Take a little bit of your blinders off. And understand also some other position of the situation. If you don't know somebody else, maybe they don't mean what you think they mean. Not all white men being racist or sexist or what and that and some black people being also superior there are things that um, black people be superiors you don't have only white superiors you have also black superiors black people that believe them is superior term and if we go to superiorists the human being is the most delusional of all. There are all think that there be superior on other animals. All think of all of some kinds of delusional mindset. That they can do whatever they want to other beings. And that somebody else have to respect them, even if they do something horrible against other living beings. Like uh, eating meat, like eating dairy. That's actually what you do. So awaken humans, stop feeling so fast offensive by somebody else's words. I take occasion on some on this other side to me. Maybe you've been not the victim. Maybe you've been the victimizer. You've been the one that's not been the the no. Maybe you don't examine the situation for 100% and you only um, not, you only 
take the symptoms of the disease, if you understand what I say, instead that you take to the root of the disease. Can you understand what I mean? Believe what you want. Believe what you want. You can also say what you want. I have a very big shell for that kind of things. And you have also to get a little bit more built on your sick on your soul. Only to say it in this way. Become more open minded, have an open vision, and if it comes to the end point, use logic. Place yourself in the position of the other and think what, what so you do if you've been in the situation. Not all white persons being rich, not all black people being poor. Examine always the victim position of you. And on top of that, the ones that m suffer the most being the animals. Let me, let me uh, not forget that Obama, that um, douchebag, that pathetic douchebag house nigger. I say house nigger because he exactly act with the house niggers in the time of the slavery. He protected the, the slave masters, he protected the rich man, he is proud to be with a rich man with the same party that by their means and the ideas of Malcolm X was more racist than the Republican Party and is today more, uh, more speciesist than the Republican Party because they are active uh, try to take the, fo the voice from the people that come up for the victims there are Obama and his, uh, his posse is cronies have uh, make laws up to protect the victimizers of the meat industry by make it illegal to feel to film the uh, animals that be tortured by the um, abusers from, from the meat dairy and egg industry Democrats so great idea but the reality is far from that. Can it be that there have been sheep, uh, that there have been wolves in sheep clothes? That there have been come up like an angel, but be nothing more than a devil? At least from the uh, Republicans. You can say what you want, you can say what you think, in contrast with the uh, Democrats, that are all to take your freedom of speech away. And if we want to evolve as a society, we have to not to take somebody else's freedom of speech, we have to try to talk with the um, population. And try to show them the difference of it. And on top of that, it is for you, FBI. You called so much said groups terrorists. But look also a little bit about yourself. Calling the elf and the armed terrorists, then also the Allied forces be terrorists. So also the 
on the ground groups that free the slave from the West. So, being then also the Allied, the Allied forces when they broke down the cage of Birkenhaus and Auschwitz. The elf have um, strict non-violence protocol and there have nothing in the 40 years that have been active harmed somebody else when the FBI constant harassed and attack uh, weaker groups You mean nothing more than st than uh, capitalist cronies that want to have an image of doing good work. The uh, the Alf and the Animal Liberation Front they're being the biggest heroes on this time. They go in concentration camps called slaughterhouses and free animals have no rights, just like the slaves in the, sla in the time of the slavery, have no rights and freedom. Since when is it an act of terrorism to free some other living beings and not an act of terrorism to abuse, torture and rape and murder other living beings? Dictation on the suffering waves by yourself to sound. Look, it's from another perception. I know why you do this. Because if a population being scarce, sometimes the only way to make them less scarce is to take some criminals. And if you don't can find criminals, you make criminals. I'll have a if you not be careful the media wants to let you hate the ones that fight for you and want to want you to um, love the ones that oppress you that's how powerful the media has become the media cult Cult, sure. So let me not uh, go on somebody else's uh, freedom of speech. There's also one of the human rights laws, Article 10. Protect your rights to have your own opinions, even if it being against popular opinions without interference of the states. So if somebody wants to take your rights, actually this is kind of defamation. It wants not to be seen this way, maybe because of the states and how they're being set up. But it is in reality kind of defamation. Now, what I want to say is not that uh, the laws, so if I say many times, the laws be not the absolute, the security of morality and of justice, it being just the status quo. This is just how would the majority see it on one particular moment in time. And if we lose your logic, we have to write to um, challenge the law. There's also one of the human rights laws. As far as I know, this Article 5, I think so. Or 4, um, yes, one of the two. Give you the right to um, protect. Uh, so um, be your own 
uitgekijkt in een roll shot. En dan zo to challenge die, die een status quo. So, let me try to understand the other's position and come to logical and rational decisions. Instead that we don't want to live in the reality and that we create subcultures because we don't can face reality. Come up humans. Become rational. Become the rational beings that you always claim to be, you stand to be. Apathetic, selfish, myopic, and out touch, out touch with reality. This whole culture that we have set up is not the reality, it is a kind of matrix actually. It is a kind of uh, programming. This is a kind of uh, extremely big game. We've been a part of an extremely big game from uh, the rich people in this world. You win just one loper or one tower or one horse. <laughs> you win just one object in the game, as long as you tolerate that. And so as always, go vegan. Treat other living beings just like you want that you be treated yourself. As long as, so far as nobody wants to be raped, aka and inseminate or tortured and mass murdered aka slaughtered or being kidnapped and put on a wheel of arm a baby child concentration camp it is more than it is not more than logic to become vegan and follow my, subscribe to my channel and to my Instagram and to my Instagram and my other social media to follow me and if you have questions put them in the description below and I'll be glad to answer them